Hi guys. Just I just wanna wanna ask uh, at the beginning when when I came into the meeting, uh, I heard some about a first certain kind of frustration and so on. What what what's going on there? Well, why why is that? What what do you guys think that? I was losing my mind. Uh, it creates some frustration in some of them of the participants of the project. I want to say that I, uh, I, I felt that uh, a while back, like before I uh, sort of like went offline. I was losing my mind. Omega, but uh, I really, I think, yeah, I, I, I wouldn't know what to say about that. Uh, other than what Merck said, um, I don't have a problem <laughs> or an issue. But, Right. Uh, that, that's a good note. <laughs> no, because, yeah, that was also my, my ask. This in the vacuum, uh, do, do you yourself, did you did you yourself have a frustration or, or was it surprising to, to hear that? Since you arrived here. <laughs> well, no, I feel grateful. <laughs> <laughs> I feel grateful. I am very excited about what is going on. I think that time, time is something that sometimes makes us feel like, like that, you know, like, oh, it's, it, you know, like so many time and, and nothing is like, nothing seems to, to, to like to pull in the, in the right <laughs> space and, and it happens, you know, it happens, uh, that's why I, I developed that other calendar I, sh I share in the in the chat. Uh, you know, like to try to to get out of of regular timing because it's it's it's, it's a perception. You know, time is not real. <laughs> so, so we we get we get into it and we start to feel like time is little is less and less time to do. Things, but you know, it's I don't I don't really feel like that. Uh, I just try to to do what I can. Uh, we we can we cannot do more than that, you know. Like we are, you know, everybody is trying their best. I'm I'm sure of it, and everybody is 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 put what what they have on the table and and it's about it's about that right it's, it's, yeah. so and, and that way you also see that things all of a sudden culminate all of a sudden you, know, you look around and something is already done i would call out when uh within the document we were talking earlier and i would kind of just for sort of saying about like timing and i get i i think because you know creatives and, and music and stuff like that. Like I was, oh, it's, we're just slightly off beat right now. Like it always seems like when I try and sync up with somebody, they're just slightly off right now. And I, and I learned like to just kind of uh, let go and, and well, it's not always, I fluctuates within my own self too. But, and I think this is what I said in Dynamic Energy Budget one time is like, we got to, because uh, we're coming up with uh, she's doing the, the kernel pitch right and so I was like for me it's about like thinking in in cycles because like you, you think it's like a you're you're not going anywhere but it's like it's like a, a loop and a cycle and, and change is like a horizon and like the, the this is what the process of, over the product is like this this long bubbling process of it like even what Dogas was saying, like when you're like in it, you, you, you're like the frog that boiling. You can't see all of the dynamic uh, connections and, and and changes that are happening within your own like matrix network of your dynamic energy, right? Until like you like you stop and you reflect over that horizon, and you see oh shit, like all that stuff changed and like all these little points like made me change in, in that in that point and, and that's what i'm kind of like getting to like with these like contact points even with my own thinking of yeah. like these these little 
points that that radiate that energy where the the intersections like what i was even what i was sharing within the vacuum um of kind of like my own pitch for the mandala spores it's an access point uh to start making uh, meaningful novel connections uh to the transdisciplinary nature of the crypto economic flower when you make these connections and have these insights you meant a spore uh, insights so you can weave a crypto economic flower mandala narrative, a constellation of where your energy, interest, and curiosity intersect to create a access point within the crypto economic flower, grow your, your crypto economic mycelial network, trigger insights, and form a web, of, a wisdom web of creative feedback. Because I think like later it's about like the feedback over time that wow. you get with that, that yeah. network of exchanging of, of your, your insights with other insights. Wow. Yeah. Also, value. Yeah. 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 Also about timing. You know, like it, it depends for um where, where's your uh, point of you know what what is your perspective of it. It, it. To me, it is about a legacy. You know, this kind of project it probably will grow and grow and change over the time, and we're just like putting the first little pieces of it, but. Right. It will change, and it's it's about for me and and on on Web three work. You know, we are in this early stage, and it's all about a legacy. It's all about for future <laughs> generations and people that will come and and discover oh, yeah, these and yeah. right. So so that's why I'm not worried about the time at all. You know, because I it's enough to 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 put a little uh, you know like something into it i, I was no, no it's going really really well to from from that point of view um you know from this point of view not uh, have uh, are we finished with the library yet but all of these insights that are coming together and if now now really i see it uh that the next thing that i would like to focus is again help harvest how can we make these uh, visible right i think that's the only thing because this process is opaque to, to people who come from the on and off for example or who are not used to working like this uh, and that's majority <laughs> uh, it's very opaque like how does it work you know what are contact points and so on but I think that's the one thing, you know, you, you feel the beat and then uh, you you jump in and then you you can learn. Again, it needs huge curiosity, right? And then also it needs uh, learning and applying, getting practical. Right? Um, for example, for me, I've been um, testing many, many things and trying to get to the to the core of it and yeah i hope that uh, in the dynamic energy budget creative flow that there we will find how do we visualize this at the very least because it's going to be very hard to put in concepts <laughs> or in a new uh, you know the, the new calendar i think it's, it's the showing a direction or, or what is the difference that could also be uh, possible uh, that's the that's the big um, yeah research that is going on applied research right and if you could make that uh, put that in a bit more concrete um, I can suggest a really help. concrete example yeah um, there's a great um, YouTube video called build a tower build a team uh, it's a TED talk by a guy oh, who did yes, this yes, thing yes, called yes, the spaghetti yes. test where but his thing is is the meta version of that because he's led hundreds of these things is that um you know this is all an iterative process right so what he sees is that you know like the worst performers in that spaghetti uh building the tower with the of spaghetti with mushroom on top the people who are the worst at that are recent business school graduates right and then um ceos are like 
forty percent better if they have their admin assistant with them, <laughs> and like there's just all this interesting stuff. But of course, the the best people at this are the engineers and people who've trained, you know, how to be architects and so on. But then the second best and the most creative are kindergartners because all they do is iterate. They just iterate, 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 iterate <laughs> right away. So it doesn't require training, you know, to iterate. You, all you have to do is try this thing, stick the mushroom on top, did it work? Yeah. And then, and then you know, and you just build yeah. another one and build another one and build yeah. another one. So that's why you'll notice all of my graphics is circular in nature and assume yeah. that you're going to go through uh, uh, repeated iterations where it then would stack up uh, over time into a, into a spiral kind of foundation. So um, I got to go, guys, but thank you. Yeah, thank you. Bye-bye. So also just one uh, thing, I will be gone next week uh, as well. So uh, like we're not gonna make the, um, the the calls, but I will try and um, as I mentioned, ha harvest after that or, or um, take some time to really go through everything that happened and help put it together and also write about it such that um, this progress that you've been making in the conference library, also with the uh, curation that we all put it together, and it becomes visible that we get to the version one. The the other part is, um, you know, all this wallet action and so on. I don't know if you have ever uh, interacted with Gnosis Chain and everything. If you need help with that, no, I um, haven't. Yeah. Okay. So that's something that I've been <laughs> also, you know. Uh, telling Matt that we need these, okay, how do I, uh, you know, contributing in open source is easy, but then how, how do I actually, how am I part of the process of uh, getting this distribution and so on. Uh, that's, I will run after Matt that we have that, that everyone knows how to connect where and what and how to receive this wrapped XDI tokens and what, how to unwrap them <laughs> and then maybe uh, jump a few other hoops until you get there where you need them. Um, and the other thing that I really want to take up in version 2 or, or in preparation for version 2 would also be of course the tokenomics because that's what I can uh, bring to the table. Um, yeah, so thanks again, like it's amazing. You heard from Manu. <laughs> And uh, he's really, really impressed after seeing actually what uh, has happened, and that uh, proves the other point that we 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 have this beautiful collaborations and, and progress. But it's like, uh, and Satori, you're creating these amazing videos, <laughs> right? But uh, we need to be communicating likely more um, in tech and maybe also outside tech. Because this library is going to be really, really great. I was losing my mind.